Come on in, boy. He only has a crossbow. Okay, that's good to know. Alright, everyone. Welcome back to Rust. Our stockings are full with stuff again. 300 stone, 4 chocolate bars. That's alright. 100 stone and 40 metal. That's alright, too. And 200 wood and... So, this is basically everything we got from the stockings, which is amazing. Just for, for doing nothing, I get this amount of stuff. It's cool. Alright, everything in here is still standing, that is very nice. But let's just check the area. This base is new. Let's check this one. Alright, it's a wooden door. It's nice. And a wooden foundation here. I need to make a flamethrower. There's a floating pookie bear here. What are, what are you doing here, buddy? Who left you here? That's not nice. This one's also new. I could rate this if I have some uh, satchel charges. What? I made this jump. Holy shit, that's cool. Fuck, but I couldn't see anything in there, so it's not worth it. I had no idea I can jump onto doors. That's amazing. I need to practice more on my jumping skills. Okay guys, so I am happy with this base now. I'm not going to expand this anymore because I, I want it to be small inside here because everything looks raided and people are probably not going in there, hopefully. So I will just run around as a naked going in a random direction. Let's just say walking this way until we found anything good like a red town or maybe other players because I want to get it better at PvP. So I will try to run into people. I'm, I'm forcing myself to do more PvP. That's why I only got a bow with me and not anything special. Also on the way I'm just going to destroy some barrels. Hopefully get some metal pipes and if I make it back alive I can use those metal pipes to make a flamethrower which would be very nice because of all the all the bases around here with the wooden doors I could raid then with the flamethrower. But unfortunately I didn't find any gears, uh, any metal pipes, sorry. But yeah, hopefully we will run into some people that I can fight. Hopefully not any people with uh, awesome weapons, like AKs and stuff. So I can still fight them. Oh, there's a guy there. I hit him. Yes! Got him. Fuck you. Woohoo! What does he have? Okay, nothing too special. Well that's good, that's good. I'm I'm just going to go back and drop it off in the in the base. Oh there's a naked here. Let's go back there and maybe see if he's coming back to a, to his body. But I think he didn't have a base. Because he had so little stuff. He was probably just a naked, like not a naked, but a fresh spawn who found some stuff. But he was pretty mad that I killed him. Fuck you. So many nodes in this area. If I would expand my base, I could do that easily because of all the nodes here. But I don't want to. It's so, so obvious or so suspicious if I expand the base. It makes it a lot, a lot more like a target to raid. That's why I'm not a fan of expanding a base or having huge bases. I like having small bases that look like not raidable or that, that there's no use of raiding them because you don't get a lot of stuff out of them. Oh my god, these frame drops. Why is this? I. I even used some tips I found on Reddit and stuff, like the exclusive full screen thing and other stuff that that should fix all the all the frame rate problems, but for some reason it's there's still so many problems with this game in, in terms of optimization. I would love it if if the development team would just spend one week or maybe even one whole month on optimization. I don't I like the game as it is right now. I like spending time on the game and stuff and I like playing it. So they don't need to add new features in my opinion. But they should fix all the all the optimization issues. I really really would love it to see they 
they doing only one month of optimization and stuff. I bet if they would do this, everyone could really, really enjoy this game. But I think a lot of people don't enjoy the game at the moment, at the moment because of all the optimization issues. Oh, it's the airfield. Hello. I don't think I can go there because of radiation, right? Oh yeah, it's already here. Ah, shit. Oh, look at that. There's an abandoned base with a stocking in it. Oh, no. what is this? Cool. Oh, I get it. So this fella wasn't a nice guy. He got some coal in his uh, stocking. What can I do with this? Nothing. It's just it's just coal. Crappy holidays. <laughs> it would be so nice if I could like take him off and put him in my base. That would be amazing. Oh, this furnace is is on. Let's run over there and see what, what kind of guys are over there. Oh, it's a naked. It's a naked, boys. Shit. Hit him. Oh, he's over there. He only has a spear, if, as far as I can see. Hit him again. No, it's lagging. Thanks for the spear, mate. Hit him again. Oh my god, ho- Fuck the leg! How much- What is going on? How many fucking shots can he take? Where is he now? Alright, let's go over to his uh, furnace and see what he left there. Holy shit, dude! Thanks for the furnace stuff. Oh, I see him over there. Hit him. Yes! Finally got him. I'm getting better with the bow. Jesus, dude. Alright. Let's head back home. Oh, shit. Fuck. Shit, someone's shooting me. Come on, please, 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 please make it back home. Shit, shit, shit. Just need to get in my base and then they don't know me that I'm here anymore. Yes, I'm in. Turn that off. Get everything. Oh, boys. That was close. His name was Sorry Girls. I prefer Mid. Interesting name. And we got another small stocking which I will put up on my wall here for sure. Just right there. There we go. We got so many mats and a few small presents. A shit ton of metal fragments now. Oh my god, that was some nice killing there. Got some nice loot of that. Should I unwrap these? Nah, no, let's save up for a bigger one. Okay guys, so in this direction where we killed this, uh, this naked guy who was running the furnace, there's a roof camper now. So I think I will go over this way and run behind the airfield and maybe see if we can kill some more guys. Oh, they just spawned some components here. Oh, nice. Look at that. There's a present over here. Okay, five small presents. Nice. Don't know if there was anything better in there, but I'm happy with five small presents. That means I can upgrade my other presents to a bigger one. And that's just another present. Okay. Let's try to get this one. Okay, shit, nope. Radiation is kicking in, not going there. Oh boy. Shit, he hit me. Crap, there are two guys. Oh fuck, I can't, I, I can't do anything against two guys, sorry. 
Oh, more presents around. Oh yes, nice, a medium present. And some more normal presents, medium and small. All right, let's upgrade this one. Now we have three medium ones. I'm going to open up one. It's another water pipe shotgun, that's nice. Let's unwrap another one. 1.5k stone, holy shit, that's amazing. Okay, let's just unwrap all of them. 150 low grade, amazing. Some food and a medical syringe, awesome. If anyone is going to raid this base, they are going to be so lucky. They will, they will enjoy this a lot. Oh shit, people are exploding some stuff. If I would have a P2 or anything, I would try to counter raid this, but with only a bow, I cannot do much. Okay guys, I uh, made all of this stuff now. I'm still crafting some uh, wooden armor for the legs. But I want to get back to the place where those two people killed me. And I will try to kill them. Because now I have a decent, some, some decent gear. And also a water pipe shotgun with four shots. Well, five. So hopefully I'm able to kill them. If not, I'm not mad because I still have a lot of stuff on my base. Oh shit, who's shooting? Someone was shooting me, but not with a gun. Oh wait, here I am. Come on in, boy. He only has a crossbow, okay, that's good to know. Oh yes! Holy shit, dude! That's an awesome gun. Here's a nice skin, 2000 wood. Holy shit, yes boys! That's the third kill in this episode. I told you guys there's going to be more PvP in this episode. Thanks for all the stuff. Well, now we have some great armor. And another water pipe shotgun and a crossbow, that's nice. I think I need to expand the base a little bit because I'm running out of space here. Okay boys, you know what? I'm going to destroy this wall and that's going to take 6 or 8 metal pickaxes. Let's see if we can make that amount. Wait, we have one in here. Do we have any more somewhere else? Also, I'm going to use these as well. I don't think those do a lot of damage on the wall, but who knows? Oh no, they're quite, uh, quite, quite good. So let's use them as well. Also the wooden ones. I'm just going to use all the tools that I have at the moment to destroy this wall. It's a nice skin on it. Let's take a look on this. Oh, it's the fire axe. That looks so amazing, don't you, don't you think? It looks very good. What's going on outside? Wait a second. I need to put this stuff away. Someone's getting wood outside. Let's see who it is. Oh, right over there. Hit him once. Okay, let's rush him. Yes, killed him. T-Rex, okay. Hello, boy. Give me your stuff. So, oh my god, what's going on in this episode? Jesus Christ, thanks for all the stuff. Holy shit. That's the fourth kill. I just need to sit in my base and kill the people that are running around here. No need for farming. 1500 stone again. Jesus Christ. Look at that. The Holy shit. We have so much stuff, man. So much stuff. Ah, oh, I don't even know where to put all this stuff anymore. Alright, before I do anything else, I will just destroy this wall here. And try to expand the base a bit. Oh, I heard a water pipe outside. Oh, that's close. Where the hell did this come from? Probably somewhere over here. Oh, right there. What is he doing? Why is he just shooting around? What's wrong with him? Oh, what? 
Thanks for the water pipe. Dark monkey. Also, thanks for the center hat. Let's kill number six in this episode. Oh boy. I, I can't say it enough. I told you boys. It's going to be more PvP in this episode. Alright, another water pipe shotgun. <laughs> so much fucking stuff. Oh my god, I love it. Shit. <laughs> oh my god, just two health and the fucking pickaxe broke down. There we go. Okay, oh, that's Twig up there. Oh, wait a second. Maybe I can put ladders right here on the wall and then build up there. What was that? I heard something outside. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh, oh my fucking god. Fuck your Christmas, I'm sorry but no. That just scared the shit out of me. How did he open up my, my wall here? Oh wait, one of you was talking about that something was made out of twig. Did you mean this roof? Was this roof made out of twig the whole time? If yes, I am so sorry. I am so fucking stupid. Oh my god. Well, okay. That's another kill for this episode. <laughs> oh, my stockings are back on again. Let's see what's in them. Ah, shit. Some coal. I was a nice guy. I wasn't... Oh no, sorry. Never mind. I killed a lot of people, so I'm, I, I got a lot of coal, probably. In here, 70 metal. Nice. Okay, nice. Nice, 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 nice. And in here is a medical syringe as well. Awesome. I like these stockings. They should keep this stuff in the game. That's so amazing. Let's check what else he had. Okay, nothing. Not, not much. Oh my god. Fuck. Fucking shit, that scared me. Come on, respawn, please. Faster. He's probably just camping my door right now. Oh wait, I have an idea. I have a very good idea, I think. I will wait until the rifle ammo is finished. And then I will put down the auto turret right here. And open up the door and hopefully the auto turret is going to kill this guy. Oh boy, hopefully, 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 hopefully that's going to happen. I think he's running now. Oh, he left a bow. That's nice of him. He probably heard that I put down the auto turret and then he he went away. Let's turn this off so no one hears it. But as soon as I hear anything outside, I will turn this on and open up the door. And also one of you said in the comments that you like the skin of my bone club. I like it as well, it's nice. It's called Little Friend. It's just about 2 euros or something. But it looks so cute, I think. It's amazing. Nice, now I'm up here. It's pretty good. I just need to upgrade all of this stuff up here. Oh boys, it's Christmas. It's Christmas. Okay, this time I am waiting until I get a large one. Because I want to open up a large one and see what's in there. I once got a pump shotgun and also, well, the auto turret, of course, in the last episode. But I want to know what else I can get from the large presents. There's one thing that I need a lot of, which is metal, because I want to make some more doors in this area. I want to add a door right here, like a doorway here, also a doorway right here, and then a doorway right here, so I can open up the door and look who is standing in front of my base. So I think that's, that's kind of a good idea. I will also... Fin oh shit, I will also put walls around here and then just nothing in here so um, it's just a protection so no one can destroy the floors up there. Actually I could go all the way around here and use like all of this space up here. Maybe we'll do that 
I'm not sure right now, but for now I will just put another uh, doorway right here. And that should be it. And maybe, maybe I might add a double door right here, which I can then open up and go through here. Get up here, close the door and then move on. Because I really, really want to close up this area so no one can can destroy this, this floor right there. There we go. Now I can look down there if someone is camping my door. And I also have this door where I can get around here. I will leave this all open, but I will upgrade these foundations or floors right here to stone. And also these walls to stone. And I will try to put a double wall, a double door right there. I might upgrade this part or build a wall there. Oh. Someone's coming in. Oh yes, I can use this as a bait. Oh my god, that's so good. Furnace is done. Yes! What? He had nothing? Why is there nothing on him? That's like the weirdest thing ever. Oh, I totally forgot about these. What's in here? Some wooden food, nice. Two yoga pistols. Holy shit, that's amazing. No, my other two stockings broke. God damn it. And also, as I said, I can just put this furnace on and leave it as a bait and then just camp up there and wait for people to come in here. I think that that could actually work. Alright guys, I would love to play some more and kill some more people and get the base going a little bit more and stuff, but I gotta go and uh, edit this video. So I'm happy that we got all of this now. I hope the base is not going to be raided the next time I play. I hope I can play tomorrow. Uh, probably not. Maybe the day after that. I don't know. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed this with all the PvP and stuff. I told you boys there's going to be more PvP in this episode. Hopefully as much PvP in the next episode. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did then please leave a like. It supports me a lot. And if you have any great tips or something. Then leave a comment down below. I would appreciate that. I hope to see you in the next video. Until then. Have a great day. And goodbye.